You guys might be wondering why I made the thumbnail and the title the way I did, but uh, but uh, yeah, this build gets a 93 strength, which is just absolutely insane. Like the defense on this build is just absolutely insane. I don't even know how this build is possible. You can literally get rebounds. Like he's literally way too little and the dunking on this build is actually pretty decent as well. Like you literally can score in the paint a lot of the times. You get physical finisher as well. So you, you could be very physical in the paint. I ain't gonna lie to you. And another thing on defense, like you're literally gonna be able to get get a contest in the paint like i promise you right now and then you guys also can shoot very well on this build i promise you right now like i'm literally fading on the three like look at me shooting bro i can literally dribble on this build as well it gets anchor breakers like look at what i'm doing bro chad Marsh slide fade to the corner green right in his face i promise you bro this is the best build in the game and now i'm gonna show you guys how to actually make this build and give you guys the animations for it all right so what you guys are gonna want to do is first go to the main menu and you guys are gonna want to scroll over to a new my career slot obviously just click on it and then obviously you guys are just gonna want to create a new player once again all right and then just go to create your own don't use pro tune nba builds or community builds you guys can choose whatever handles you guys want that personally doesn't matter but i always choose right and then you guys can choose whatever jersey number you guys want to me personally, I always do 22 because that's like my favorite number. All right. And position, you guys are going to want to go shooting guard, okay? The height, you guys are going to want to go six foot four. All right. You guys are going to want to go 233 as the weight. All right. So make sure you guys do that. And then you guys are going to want to go 610 for the wingspan. Now, I'm going to give you guys all the stats and why they are the way they are. Okay. So first things first, you guys are going to want to put your three all the way up maxed out to a 91 okay you're gonna get 91 three-pointer 81 mid-range you get silver dead eye silver limitless gold set shot specialist now if you guys are gonna play rec i can you know tweak this build or you guys can tweak this build however you guys want this is a very good ones twos and threes build okay so make sure you guys make this build if you guys want to play ones twos and threes for fives i will make a different version of this build in this video okay so max the three out of 93 as you guys can see 81 mid-range is more than enough 91 three is more than enough um you guys are gonna want to put your driving dunk to an 80 okay 80 driving dunk is honestly more than enough because to be honest with you i'm getting good animations no matter what with having 80 driving dunk you guys are going to go with a 45 standing dunks you guys still get them standing dunk animations as well in the paint and then your post control you're going to go to go to a 43 okay so you guys could kind of post up a little bit um it's not going to make much of a difference but it will a little bit and then go to a 71 layup that will give you guys a physical finisher once you guys put your strength up which you will later on and then your ball handle you're going to want to put it to an 86 okay make sure you guys put that on an 86 your speed ball you're going to want to go with an 86 as well and then you guys will have gold lightning launch so obviously that's a plus right there so you can already dunk pretty decently you can shoot very well and you can dribble very well on this build all right and this build doesn't even have cap breakers on it right now imagine it with cap breakers you guys get silver ankle assassin you guys get silver handles for days silver unpluckable gold lightning launch and then this is the thing that makes this build very very good okay the perimeter defense is going to be a 94 so you're going to get a ton of stops on the game, bro. You get gold challenger, gold on bomb is gold pick dodger. You guys literally get an 85 steal as well, which is going to be very good in this game, obviously. You guys get silver glove, gold interceptor. You guys are going to want to put your block all the way up to a 68. That's going to give you guys high flying denier on bronze. And then you guys are going to want to put your interior defense to a 70. All right. Now you guys are going to get a ton of stops on this build, but wait, there's more. I promise you. You guys get a 70 offensive rebound, which is absolutely insane. You guys are going to be able to get a ton of offensive rebounds after missing a layup or something. And it's just absolutely insane, bro. Another thing on this build, it's a 94 speed. As y'all know, Jason teleports around the map. You feel me? In the game, he teleports, bro. He's just really fast, bro. Um, his agility is very good as well. And that's why I chose to make this build a Jason build or a name it that because the strength is a 93 you guys get hall of fame you guys get legend strong handle and legend immovable enforcer if y'all don't know legend immovable enforcer improves the defensive player's strength when defending ball handlers and finishers now that's going to give you guys a ton of crazy good animations on defense and then you guys also get strong handle on legend which is also going to be a lot better for when you guys are driving to the paint it's going to make it a lot easier to get a good animation a strong handle animation um box out beast obviously it's for rebounds you guys are gonna get a ton of those with the 70 offensive rebound all right and this is the build the way it is okay this is literally the build the way it is you guys can put more on whatever you guys personally want i'll probably just do like interior or you know what i'm saying post control or whatever you guys personally want all right 
So this is my build. This is the build that I would recommend to make if you guys are playing ones, twos, threes, you know, whatever the case may be. Okay, now you guys, if you guys don't want to have a 94 speed, okay, what you guys are going to want to do is go to like a 90, uh, probably like a, I don't know, let's see, we can lower the agility a little bit, so it's not so low, alright, and you can lower the speed a little bit, and let's see what the lightning launch is on, it's still on gold, everything's good, okay, we still got a movable enforcer, um, the only thing we might have to change is the perimeter defense back up to get a movable enforcer, okay, so if you guys want pass accuracy, the most you're probably going to get is like a 75. You guys can also put your free throw up as well um, to like whatever you guys want. You could do a 99 to be honest with you. And you guys can get an 83 pass accuracy. If you guys really want to, you know what I'm saying, get rid of speed and stuff like that, you guys can do that. You can get some defensive rebound. You guys can get some offensive rebound. So this is what I would do if I wanted like a wreck type of build. This is the build that I would make. You guys have an amazing free throw. You guys have a very good... Uh, you know what I'm saying? Perimeter defense. You guys get ball handling. You guys can dunk pretty decently. So this is how I would make it. You guys also get gold dimer. You guys also get silver break starter and bronze versatile visionary. So to be completely honest with you, this would be the perfect build if you guys are trying to play just fives or pretty much just play everything, okay? And then the build that I showed you guys earlier obviously is going to be better for ones, twos, threes, and um you know what i'm saying all the other game modes besides fives so to be honest with you it's all your personal preference you could still use this on the ones like you could still use this on the ones i promise you right now you're still gonna get move one forcer animations you're still gonna get steals you're still gonna have 93 strength with um strong handle the only difference is you don't have as much speed and you don't have like you know what i'm saying as much, it's pretty much just just speed i ain't gonna lie um and then, you know, you guys still get the same three, still get the same ball handle, perimeter defense. You know what I'm saying? You get a little bit better interior, a little bit better standing dunk, um, as you all can see. And that's pretty much what you guys are going to want to do, okay? You guys get gold shifty shooter as well. So you guys are going to be able to fade in the corner. And you guys can also use cap breakers. You guys can put your cap breakers on this perimeter defense and get a 99 perimeter defense, which is just absolutely insane. That's for your first cat breakers, and for your second set of cat breakers, you guys can get to an 86 driving dunk if you guys really wanted to, or even just an 84 or something. Or you guys can make your speed even faster and put it at a 99 speed on the other build that I showed you guys. Or you guys can put it on ball handle. You guys can put the rest of your cat breakers on ball handle to get 92 for Trey Young animations. All right. So this is the build that you guys are gonna want to make if you guys are want to play fives. You know what I'm saying? Wreck pro am whatever the case may be this is going to be the best build for your you know what i'm saying uh game mode right there all right but if you guys just want to play other game modes then you guys are just going to want to make the other build which is the build that i actually made all right so now i'm going to show you guys all the animations i'm going to show you guys the best jump shot and i'm going to tell you guys exactly why they are the best okay all right so for the dribble animations now most of these are the same as my little guard the only reason I don't have the same on my as my little guard is because my little guard has a 92 ball handle. This build only has an 86, but with cat breakers, you guys can get it to a 92 if you guys really want it. The only thing I would change is the signature size with the Trae Young and the behind the back of Trae Young. Other than that, to be completely honest with you, you pretty much have the best dribble moves in the game. All right, the escape moves is obviously going to be different. You guys are going to want to use um, Curry. But to be honest with you, I can't get it on this build, so it is what it is. But for this build, for the Jason Voorhees build that I told you guys about, these are the best SIGs, okay? You still get Darius Garland dribble style. Pro signature size up is very good still as well. Um, John Moran, aggressive breakdown, I use that as well on my little guard. Zach Levine's escape moves are the best ones for an 86 ball handle, in my opinion. John Moran combo moves. Um, crossover is going to be D-Book. Obviously, that's always going to be very good. Your behind the back is going to be Darius Garland because you can't get Trey Young. But Darius Garland is pretty good still as well. Darius Garland hesitation to get that, you know what I'm saying, quick stop. And then step back is going to be either Zach Levine or you guys can use Tyrese Halliburton. Me personally, I use Zach Levine. Um, and then for my dribble pull up, I know you guys are going to want that. My dribble pull up is pro too. That's the fade that I've been using this whole time, okay? And then you guys are going to want to make sure you guys have um, Kyle Lowry hop jumper on so that you guys can literally do the uh, Chadmar slide. And then you guys are going to want to go Donovan Mitchell motion style as well. So now I'm going to show you guys the jump shot real quick. So the jump shot is going to be Cam Thomas base. You're going to want to go Oscar Robinson release one and Kyrie Irving release two. I use this on my small guard as well. Make sure that the visual cue is on push five ticks after the white line. And then release speed is going to be maxed out at four fours. 
Your animation blend is going to be 65% Oscar, 35% Kyrie Irving. All right, the dunk style that I use is Clay Thompson. That's really the only one that I can get on this build, considering that I have an 81 driving dunk. But to be honest with you, bro, I feel like I got a very high driving dunk. Like, I don't know why, but 81 just still seems very good. All right. So if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to drop a like, turn on post notifications. Thank you guys for the recent support. Y'all seen the gameplay on this build. Y'all seen what this build is capable of. Now, I promise you right now, this build will not disappoint you. If you guys want to play lockdown, if you guys want to play guard, if you guys want to play just like anything, bro, like you guys will literally be able to obviously beside center, but you guys can literally go crazy on this build. This build is absolutely insane. Now, this is what my build attributes are at a 96. But at an 85, the one thing that I would focus on is the main key stats. So like speed, strength, perimeter defense, steal, um, three point, you know what I'm saying? Ball handles, speed with ball. Like I would just try to, you know, upgrade the, the most important key attributes. And then another thing is, is like, I know most of you probably already have cap breakers. If I was you guys, I would put five on perimeter defense. That's going to give you guys 99 perimeter defense. All right. And then me personally... I'm probably going to put um, another five cat breakers on strength, which is going to give me um, 98 strength, which is just going to be absolutely overpowered because to be honest with you, I'm good with an 86 ball handle because one thing about this build, you guys get physical finisher and to be honest with you, it's only on, I think bronze or silver, but like, bro, it literally will bail you out a lot of the times. It's kind of like bully from NBA 2K 23 or 24. Um, but yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope this video helped you guys out a lot. Thank you guys for the recent support. We're going to be dropping a banger tomorrow. I ain't going to lie to y'all. It's going to be a different type of video. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that. But enough yapping, man. I'll see you guys in the next video.